What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Film study for rookies today, man. We're going to break down Aiden Hutchinson and we're going to go over why he's one of my most favorite guys to watch when it comes to the defensive line. Because honestly, man, he can line up everywhere. He's Mr. Versatile. Let's take a look at him right here. So on this first play, we're going to see the Falcons. They're going to run a play action, right? Take a look at the tight end. Tight end, he's going to push this way right here. Tackle, same thing. Guard, same thing, right? Everybody pushes this way except for the fullback. We're going to let the play develop. We're going to pause it about right here. Watch what Aiden does. He's actually going to jump backwards. Take a look at his footwork right here. You're see he's going to come up, bang, jump backwards, go after the quarterback right there, and he's actually going to swat this pass down. So Aiden Hutchinson, the first play, we see him line up in the wide nine, doesn't get tricked by the play action, beats the fullback right there and swats the pass down. Let's check out play number two. So as we jump to play number two, you've got Aiden Hutchinson lining up as the four eye right here. Last time we saw him outside the tight end as the wide nine. This time four eye, take a look what happens right here, man. The guard's going to pick him up, rips underneath that, and then bang, swats down another pass. First thing we're going to see is a rip move right there, bang, picks up the center right here. And I love what he's doing. He's watching the quarterback right here. Take a look. He's watching the quarterback. We're going to try and slow this down a little bit. Take a look what happens, bang. Sees when I believe Desmond Ritter right there is about to throw it. Pop. Look at that. Desmond's throwing it right there. Aiden Hutchinson swats that thing down, man. I'm telling you, he can do it all. Let's jump to play number three. So as we jump to play number three, we've seen Aiden Hutchinson line up outside the tight end, right? Line up inside the tackle. This time, he's lining up outside the tackle. Take a look at this spin move right here. Take a look what happens. Tackle's expecting a little bit of help potentially from the running back. He doesn't get it, and he gets completely demolished on this play what made this work we're going to let the play develop we're actually going to pause it about right here so if we pause it right here you're going to see the tackles actually in decent positioning to pick up Aiden Hutchinson on top of that Aiden Hutchinson goes too far to the outside running backs right there as well to pick him up now watch what Aiden does right here we're going to let it develop we're going to pause it about right here watch this inside arm right here for Aiden Hutchinson we're going to let it go we're going to pause it about right here as you're going to see, he raises that inside arm. What does that do? That makes the tackle engage with Aiden Hutchinson. Now look at this, right? Tackle's facing this way right here. He's facing parallel to Aiden Hutchinson. Aiden Hutchinson's actually using that inside arm as leverage. He's going to use that, hook around that arm, and then bang, spin back around. Look at that one more time. As you're going to see, he's going to hook right there, use that to create leverage, then use this outside arm at the time to swing him back around and then he's taking down the quarterback. One more time now, bang, hooks, uses that to create leverage, pushes himself around, bang. All because he got that tackle to get his hands up right there, boom. Great stuff, man, let's keep it going. On this play right here, you're gonna see Aiden Hutchinson do another move, man. We've seen the spin move, a rip move, and right here, we're gonna see a bull rush into a stab into a rip move, man, what? You know we got to run that back. Let's run that back real quick. So the first thing we're going to see right here is a bull rush. Bang. Look at that. Lowers his head and just drives right there. All right. The offensive lineman's kind of holding his own. So what does Aiden Hutchinson do right here? He's going to turn that into a stab move. And when he does that, he can actually create more separation right there, right? One hand out, create a little bit of leverage. Watch what happens next. He's going to disengage, rip underneath. And he's right there taking down the quarterback. That's crazy right there. Three moves in probably what? Three to four seconds. One more time. Bull rush. Stab. Rip underneath. And then he's right there. I mean, he just makes this look too easy. Bull rush. Bang. Stab. Rip. Boom. Taking down the quarterback, man. Great stuff right there. All right, guys. The next play we're going to look at, you got Aiden Hutchinson once again lining up outside the tackle. And he's taking down the quarterback. How does he make this look so easy? Let's run this back. So right here, the Lions run a stun, as you're going to see. Now we're going to pause it right here. It looks to be pretty even, right? Usually on a stun, you catch the guard over here with the tackle, then bang, and wraps around. Usually, right? But right here, it looks to be pretty even. But about right here is where it changes. Aiden Hutchinson has his outside arm up under the guard's plate right there. The next thing to do is watch his inside arm right here. He's actually going to swat down the wrist of the Packers guard right there. He's going to swat it down, bang. Now take a look what happens right there. He's going to swat the wrist down, bang. Now he's got two hands up under the plate right there, and he's just steering him away 
That way he can go get the quarterback. I mean, we're seeing it all from Aiden Hutchinson. Take a look one more time. Bang. The guard's actually in decent positioning, but Aiden, man, the fundamentals he has is crazy. Just drives the guard away. I mean, take a look right here. He is literally pushing him to where he wants him to go. Look at this right here, man. That is crazy. And as you're going to see, man, taking down Jordan Love one more time. I love this right here because it looks pretty even. And Aiden Hutchinson just unleashes, man. Next one. All right, guys. Right here, the Packers are going to run a play action strong side right here. Watch Aiden Hutchinson on this play. He's going to line up opposite side, back side. And right there, man, he's in Jordan Love's face. Let's run this back real quick. To me, this is basically the Euro step of the NFL. So as we know, Aiden likes to get to the outside, right? Everybody who watches film knows that. So obviously this tackle right here does. So watch what he does right here. Tackle immediately. Take a look right here. Immediately we're going to see him come to the outside right here. That's exactly what Aiden wants on this play. Maybe not every play, but on this play this is what he wants, right? So take a look right here. Let it develop. We're going to pause it right here. Look how far out the tackle jumps. So Aiden's like, all right, perfect. I get exactly what I want. Now watch what Aiden does. You're going to see Aiden's going to step to the outside and then bang. Like I said, it's going to be Euro step back to the inside. One more time so you guys can see. One step to the outside, bang. Gets the tackle to face parallel right here. Bang. And what's Aiden do? Like I said before, it's a Euro step. So he uses his outside step as leverage. Hops off that foot and then bang. He's coming back inside. Take a look. Bang. Right? Bang. Uses that inside arm right here to create leverage. Closes down right there. Swims over the top. Bang. Man, he is coming in. One more time. I love this right here. Euro step. Bang, bang. Swim move over the top. And he's taking down Jordan Love. Well, not taking him down, but you guys know what I mean. Let's keep it going. So right here against the Bears, you're going to see him lining up outside the right tackle once again. Look at this. A little stab move to a rip. And right there, man, he's causing fumbles. Let's run this one back real quick. I love this right here. So once again, man, he's lining up on the outside. Now the question is, how far does his tackle go out to pick up Aiden Hutchinson? Let the play develop. All right. He's staying pretty close. So what's Aiden do? He tries to use that stab move, create a little bit of separation, and get a little leverage. He's also doing that to try and get the tackle to engage right here. And if he does... Bang, Aiden's going to rip underneath, right? He's going to bend that shoulder, get low right there, rip, and look at that, right? He's flattening that out right there. One more time so you guys can see. Stab, rip underneath, flatten it out, and taking down Justin Fields. One more time, man, I love this right here. Stab, get the tackle to engage, rip underneath that, and just look at the positioning right here. Aiden's going this way, tackle's going this way. It's over, man. It's over right there. Great stuff once again. So on our last play, once again, you had Aiden Hutchinson lining up outside the tight end. And take a look what happens right here, man. Take a look what happens. You can't put the tight end on him. Come on, man. Take a look what happens. Bang. Easy swim move over the top. That tight end is not stopping Aiden Hutchinson, man. So take a look at this one more time, man. Great stuff right here. I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. I mean, it's pretty clear. He can line up just about anywhere on the defensive line and cause havoc. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Stay tuned. More content coming soon.